it's Cindy and today I am bringing you my last two Lip Love subscription bags. I have not opened them yet except for taking them out of the boxes. Um, I was gone for quite a long stint and so I haven't, this video is so late, but it's my last review for the company. Um, it's my last two bags so let's get into it and get this review going. So December's bag says life should not only be lived it should be celebrated and it has these cute little penguins and it says la 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 all over it it's one of those boho bags and let's just see what we got or what we have you have the card with all of the pricing on it so our first product here is a lip let's see lip butter by jelly pong pong the container is really cute. It's owls. And let's just open it and see what the color is. It says the color is owls. So we'll see what the actual color looks like. Ooh, it's kind of like a orangey looking color. Well, that's pretty. Let's watch it. Okay, it's creamy. Very pretty color, very pretty. The container is really cute. Little owls all over it. So it's about Jelly Pong Pong. Next product we have is Trifle Cosmetics. And it is another paper container. Um, it says Cheek Parfait. And it has donuts and cake and croissants and things such as that on it. This coffee dessert is the look and the lid's coming out okay let's just see what this looks like all right here is what it looks like roll it up i think and we'll swatch this this is for the cheeks there's the color it's kind of strange it's an odd texture but Kind of a perfumey kind of smell. And let me that out and see. It's really bright. Um, I'm not sure on that one. So there's that. Okay. Next, Lip Crystal Long Wearing Lipstick by So Susan. And if it's a color. Let's see if it says a color on the inside. Okay, here is the color. Liquid crystal. I guess that's the color. Here's the tube. Let's open it up and see. It has that strange perfume that they use in their lip products. I don't understand the smell. It stays quite a long time. I don't know if it's because their products are cruelty free or what, but it's a it's a it's a really strong perfume smell. Um, but it's this is brown. I'm not sure on wearing this color, but um, I know that it might be able to be used. We'll see. And the last product in my December bag is a So Susan Kabuki brush. And it's, it's a pretty nice little brush. It's tiny. And this is plastic. Um, it's not super dense. It's really loose. Um, so it'd be nice for dusting off like eyeshadow to fall out and things like that underneath the eye. So it's a cute little brush. Um, that is the December bag. Let's look at the pricing on this. It says that the canvas bag, as always, is $12. The Kabuki brush that I just showed you, <clears throat> excuse me, is um, $22.95. Um, it's, the, the brush itself, in uh, my opinion, at first, is um, cheap. The plastic, uh, I don't think it's worth $22.95. There's a lot of other makeup brushes out there that are higher quality um, for that price. So, but that's $22.95. The Owl's lipstick in this container, $18.95. And the Cheek Parfait, this they sell for $22.95. And then the bonus item, this Crystal Lipstick, 
they say is $21.95. So that's the pricing for the December bag. Let's move on. I think this is a really cute bag. This is the January bag. It's actually a plastic canvas instead of that other. And the print is actually on the bag. It's not an iron on. So I think this is a great improvement for So Susan um, for their bags. So let's get into it and see what products we got for the month of January. Again, the card that tells the prices. We'll do that last. And let's go with this big box first. It says Liquid Go Glow Liquid Luminizer Trifle Cosmetics. Okay. And here's the container. It in little it has little ice cream cones and stuff on it. It's really cute. Um, if you could see it up, I don't know. I'll try to see if you can see that. I don't know if you can. Let's go ahead and just see what this stuff looks like. I'll do it right here. Okay, it comes out pink. It has kind of a candy-ish smell to it. Let's see. Yeah. Let's see if I can get my hand. I should have done it in the other hand. This is what it looks like. It's really pink. So that is the liquid glow. Next is a lipstick by So Susan. It's called Lip Cream in Parrots. Parrots is the color. Let me get this off so I can actually show you the container. I'll put together. It's actually a pretty container. I like parrots. And um, all of her lip parfaits, lip butters, and everything, they're always in these paper containers instead of like the heavy metal ones like from Too Faced or Urban Decay or something like that. Okay, this color is a light pink. So I will, let me swatch this hand. It's creamy like the others and it's really light pink. It's really pretty. So that's that. Next, we have Really cute packaging by Jelly Pong Pong. Lip Tensity Hydrating Lip Gloss. The packaging's really cute. It's like old style ladies and umbrellas. It's really cute. Okay, let's see. All right. We have this in color intensity. Again, it has that perfume smell that I am not a fan of. It kind of lingers and it's really strong. The cover, the coverage with this is um, is there. It's really thick. It's a gloss. You can see it covers really nicely. It's a really pretty red. Um, this brown over here is drying. Let me pull my sleeve up so I don't feel like I'm getting on my sleeve. Is drying kind of strangely. Um, but this one. We'll see how it dries as we go through this video. But that is that. And last in this is Jelly Pong Pong Dream Palette. Okay, let's see. Micronized Pure Pigments. Okay, this is an eyeshadow palette. The packaging's really cute. I like the birds. Okay, and they've got it wrapped in plastic inside of plastic, so let's see if we can get this open. Pretty easy, yeah. Okay. okay, the packaging is cute. It has uh, birds, parrots on it in a little cage, it's super cute. Let's just look at the inside. Okay, it has a little mirror, and then here are the four colors and the little brush. So let me swatch these for you, see if they come off well. Yeah, they're gonna come off good. They're they're soft. They're not quite as soft as like Buxom or Too Faced or Bare Minerals, but they're not bad. Let me see. The intensity is not quite there. Let me go ahead and do this twice so that you can actually get a feel for what the colors truly look like. They're actually really pretty colors. I think. Here you go. They're really pretty colors. You can't see that. Maybe you can see it on the end of my fingers. They are pretty. So we'll see how that goes. My others that I've gotten in the past don't come off well, so we'll see. But this is by Jelly Pong Pong. 
Okay, that was the last one in that. So let's go ahead and give you the prices. The limited edition bag is $12. The Parrot Lipstick, $18.95. The Lip Tensity by Jelly Pong Pong, $19.95. The Liquid Glow by Trifle, $19.95. And then this little eyeshadow palette, also $19.95. So that is the value of the products that is both bags, December and January's. And I just want to say at the end here, this is my last lip love review because um, I didn't have the greatest experience with lip love. The customer service um, is very hard to deal with. I um, had to call them every single month except for one to get my bag. Um, they would not send them. Uh, I, I don't think that their products are like over the top, especially for the pricing point, because there are so many other brands that are way uh, better, like Too Faced, Urban Decay, um, Buxom, Bare Minerals. I could go on and on, but you could go and even, even Make It Forever. There's just, um, you can get those products for the same pricing points, especially if you wait for sales and things like that. And the quality of their um, product within the packaging is amazing uh, compared to uh, like Trifle, So Susan, and Jelly Pong Pong. Their product is not a great product overall. The packagings are done cheaply. The, um, the fragrances that they use are overpowering if you don't like perfume or if you're allergic to strong perfumes. So I, I do have an allergy to really strong perfumes, so that part is kind of like a no-go for me. Um, but the fact that their bags come and they're usually messed up, the products are cheaply made, and because the customer service was really, really poor, I just, I can't continue my subscription with them. Um, if you like uh, more organic -y type products that don't stay on as well, but they're cruelty free and all that kind of stuff, then you might want to try So Susan and uh, Trifle and Jelly Pong Pong and all that because they, they are that. And you can tell the quality of the product isn't, uh, doesn't have as much chemical and stuff in it because of the way it wears and the way it lasts. But if you, um, if you do care about quality and you do care about all that other stuff, I would say use your money and do a different uh, bag, like do BoxyCharm, or something like that because boxy charm is like tops in my opinion um but I'm, I'm glad that i did so susan i'm glad that i had the experience of the lip love bags and that i had a chance to review them and kind of get to know their company um this is in no way meant to be derogatory against their company for other people if you want to do it i think that's great because everybody needs to try something and everybody's opinion is different but my opinion is a no-go and um, i hope that you have enjoyed my videos and, and reviews. I hope they've been helpful. And I hope that you always remember and never forget that you are beautiful. And please remember Lauren as she's away at college. And until next time, we'll see you and enjoy your day. Bye. Okay, y'all. I just went to wash my hands after putting all that stuff on my hands. And I have to show you this. That brown lipstick, I used soap. I used dish soap and I scratched it and I can't get it off. I think I'm about to use makeup remover, but that's pretty intense if they had a pretty color and you didn't mind the smell. That's kind of cool. And then the lipsticks, I can't get them to come off either. So their lipstick stays even. So if you're going to go swimming, go to water, do sweating at a gym or something, maybe you should do their lipsticks. They might actually work. So anyways, it's just an afterthought. Hope y'all have a great day. Don't forget, you're beautiful. Mm -hmm.